100% Chelsea. Chelsea 3, Bate Borisov 1. Mate, what do you think of that today? It was a good performance. Um, there were some really, really impressive players today. I thought mainly the main man, Loftus-Cheek. I mean, he was outstanding. It's the best game I've seen him play in the Chelsea shirt. And he was... That's what I need. We need to see more of him play, to be honest, because he's been... He's been a bit heavily criticised a bit by Sarri and his lack of game time. And I think, personally, I think he's done... The fact he's scored three goals tonight and he's scored more goals than both Barkley and Kovacic just shows that he is a talented player and we need to give him more game time. Just simple as that. I just think the fact that Tim Sherwood touched on the fact that he's a Rolls-Royce and he really looked like a Rolls-Royce tonight. You compare him to the other two midfielders who started. Who's the, who was the midfielder from Real Madrid? Kovacic. Who was the midfielder who was on 200k? <laughs> <laughs> I like this guy. I like this. <laughs> it wasn't Loftus-Cheek. I thought he was outstanding tonight. I thought Emerson as well was brilliant left back. Mm. I think he needs to get more game time as well because I think... Could you see him starting at Burnley maybe? Emerson? Yeah. Doubt it. I think Sarri has some sort of... He prefers Alonso for some reason. There's some things I don't particularly agree with him on. His, Alonso for me is a good player. Defensively, he's still a bit fragile. I agree with I that. I completely think so. Um, I don't understand why Willian keeps keeps starting because I mean he started I think ten games in a row and it's just this guy he needs a rest and he's probably going to have to play at the weekend because if Hazard is fully fit or not. And for me in January, I think a lot of people say striker is the main position to upgrade. I disagree completely. I think right. Really? I, I do. I think we. I do think we need a striker. But okay. I'll be honest. I was. I was worried you were going to say we don't need one. No, no. We do need one, but I. We need. I don't think there's a standout striker to get in January. People are saying, "Oh, we get Icardi. He's not. He's not going to come to us." Let's be blunt. In January, right? In January. In January. Even in the summer, I doubt it. The only. I. I. I, 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 I highly doubt it. I really doubt. I could, I could see it happening. <laughs> you could, but I, I. I personally don't. I think there's two players for me, striker-wise, that we could get in January. One is uh, Chris Jack Patek from Genoa. Genoa. Yeah. And the other one's a bit of a dark horse shout. I, I don't know if there's any room, real thing to it, but Memphis Depay is doing pretty well at Lyon. No, I don't want Memphis Depay. <laughs> we saw what he did in the Premier League. Okay. But we saw what Mohamed Salah did in the Premier League with Chelsea. Stop making good points. Florian yes, this <laughs> I mean, you look as well. Florian Tovan was shit in the Premier League and he's killing it in Ligue 1. Second top goal scorer in that league. I'd love him as well, right winger. Left footed, very good player. What about Hudson Adoy? I like him, but I think he's wasting his time here. I'll be very honest. I think he needs to, personally what I'd do, I'd, s I'd sell him in Jan with a buyback clause. Because I think he need. you look, you compare him to Jaden Sancho. In my eyes, they, they, if, if they both play, if, if he played for Dortmund, Hudson Adoy and Sancho played for Chelsea, Hudson Adoy would be doing as well as Sancho in my opinion. And unfortunately he needs to take that step. You look at, Sancho and uh, Reese Nelson, who's at Hoffenheim, he's scoring loads of goals as well. They need to take that step up. They're not just, you know, let's be honest. The fact that Victor Moses has had more game time than Hudson Odoi yeah. is just really telling. At the fact that there's a huge, there's a huge gap between youth players and mm. and the first team. That the gap is massive. One thing I do like is the fact for next week against Derby is that we're allowing Mount and Tamori to play. Just what is what does that say about obviously because we, we, I was saying just because I'm glad you brought that up because we obviously were talking about youth, you know we, we talk about Chelsea not really allowing youth to develop. However, we're seeing Mount and Tamori being given the opportunity to show Chelsea what they're capable of. Yeah. It, is Mason Mount a, another player which you feel if he was come back he'd be wasting his time, or is he someone who you know could come into this team and have an influence? Personally, if Mason Mount, I'll be honest with you, I don't. Next season, once he's done with Derby, I personally think he'll either go back to Derby or go to a Prem loan. Because I mean, if Chelsea aren't going to notice how good he did at Vitesse, I don't think they're going to notice how good he did at Derby. To be honest, that's fair enough. I think that's the case. I, I think similarly, I was a bit disappointed he went to Derby because he had other clubs that wanted him. I think Verba, clubs. Verba Bremen wanted him. I thought that would have been a great move for him. Same with Hudson Odoi. I think Leipzig wanted him mm. as an option, and I've. I have this sort of conspiracy theory on this, is that I would like to see, I'd like to see Timo Werner at Chelsea. I think he's a class player. He can play anywhere along Timo the front. Timo Werner! I know. I think he, you, you might, you might get, it'd be, it would be tasty. And plus the Leipzig interest, we can get him. He's got 18 months left on his contract. You know, I'm, I, I, I get the, the, the lack of fans base. If, you, if, you, if you've just been dropped from somewhere, because <laughs> this isn't a normal no, conversation I, I have with I, someone. I do, but most people think Icardi's the only world-class striker in, 
They only think it's a cardio bust for January. I think there's other strikers. As I said, Depay, you don't think so. I think he's a good player. Piatek, I said. Is, is, is one. May, it may be less likely in January, I but know. I was banging on about it in the summer. I'd love Wilfred Zaha. Ooh. Wilfred Zaha. I, I, Zaha, I think, is a... For me, I'll be very honest on this. I think Chelsea and Palace are very... We're, we're very sort of like... Chummy. No. <laughs> but I think Hazard... Zaha's role at Palace is the same as Hazard's role here. I think he's the main player at that club. Big, big fish in a small pond. Exactly. That's exactly what it is. Would he be good at Chelsea? Maybe. I don't think he's played that unbelievably this season, though. And for me, in January, we need to get on-form players. Okay. That's, that, for me, is the key. Look, if that, Piatek's got, I think, 13 goals in seven games. If he keeps that up, and they, want, and they don't want to pay... And he's not, he's not going to cost 60, 70 million in January. Let's be blunt. They spent three million for him in the summer. I mean, if, if they're... If they're Seller's on, market, of unfortunately. Course it is, but, but in my eyes, he's not going to say no to go to Genoa from Chelsea. I don't think he's going to be overly expensive. He can play in the Europa League. He's a very good player. There's several other players. I said Tom Ackham, he can't play in the Europa League, but I think he's got, I think, one goal less than Mbappe. He's got more, he's got more goals than Neymar. And pe I know people will go, oh, it's Liga, it's a terrible league, blah, 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 blah. So what? There's some good players in there. Just, just, if Willian went in that league, doesn't mean he'll score 30 goals there. He'll score at least 20. Yeah, debatable. It's a debate. <laughs> it's a debate. He's, 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 got two, he's got two goals this season and he's played 10 games. Loftus-Cheek's just outscored him in one game. One game. A midfielder who has been criticised a lot by some fan base who says, oh, he's lazy, he's not good enough, he's, he's never going to make it at Chelsea. I really hope he does. I don't think he's the one, though. I think, personally, same thing. I think he needs to move to further his career. Because he doesn't want to be the next Josh McEachern. He doesn't want to go Lewis Baker. That route. Gal Kakuta. We can keep going because there's so many that we've ru ruined. Mason Mount is one we need to keep an eye on. Reese James of Wigan. I think he's been outstanding at Wigan. He's been a re really class player. I've watched him play some games. I think he's really, really talented. Especially the fact you look at... We could have easily given that guy, guy him or Dujon Sterling a game instead of wasting money on Zappa Costa. Despite the fact he was okay tonight. I think the only dodgy one was Willian, but we've got to we've got to take we've got to have a manager that that understands the youth to um, first team route. So hopefully one day, after Sarri leaves, I know I'm talking about Sarri leaving now. I think he's done an amazing job, you know, with the with the players. I'm glad you said the, that because comment the sections are brutal, I mate. I know, I know, I'm, I'm used to it. <laughs> I'm used to it. I'm used to it. No, but straight up, I think he's done a great job with the yeah. team he has because I mean we scored 20, 20 goals a season and he's got. He's got to work with Moses, William, Pedro as right wingers. I mean, they're not, they're not, they're not awful, but they're not. Oh my God, they're not yeah. Mares, Sane, Abamyang. They're not on that level. They're okay, but we're not an okay team. We're the best team in London. There's a reason for that. We need to buy quality, and I think we need to keep going with that route. And tonight was a good start and a good competition. We've got a big game of the weekend. So people underestimate Burnley. They're a tough team. We've got to, we've got to go there. Keep winning. Keep winning, keep winning, keep winning. When January arrives, strengthen. Forward line. That's, that's my opinion.